Okay, welcome back to the next episode. Um, you know last episode I said we'd set up a nuclear reactor in my own time? Well, I didn't because these things can get very, shall we say, explosive. So if by chance something uh, did happen, it'd be cool if I caught it on camera. And uh, so, that another thing we're going to be doing today, well, we'll do this at the end of the episode, or the, um, these things and everything at the end of the episode, because another thing we're going to be doing today, I didn't expect to do, but I'm lucky enough to do it. I, you may have noticed already, but I've got myself a diligent drone just there, and uh, it was in this one. I did um, record taking it out of the thing, but uh, I forgot to hit the um, record button on my audio. <laughs> that insight into my messed up thing, but um, yeah. I've got a cultivated drone um, that's mated with a cultivated queen there. So yeah, that would be um, good and everything. So hopefully we'll get some good stuff out there. And this is a cultivated drone mating with a forest queen. And uh, by the way, I made these untreated frames because they're really simple and they're just sticks surrounded by string. So a little insight into what I've done so far. And it basically speeds up production. So yeah, very good. So we're going to put in this cultivated drone. Uh, well, diligent drone, sorry, into the um, into mutator gen because I believe you get a white princess out of that, and then you get a um, then I suppose you can put it to work, and then you'll get a coloured comb because that's my um, that's my guess because you need white coloured comb, and uh, you put this in here with a diligent one, and what else was it? Um, hang on, what was um, what were you looking for? White princess, that is. Wintry Princess plus a uh, uh, Diligent Drone. So there's my Wintry Princess. And we put that in there. Um, hello? Oh, that's a Wintry Queen. Okay. Um, have I got a Wintry Princess? Okay, yeah, I knew I had another one. It's in this chest here. And uh, yeah, so this place is getting littered with chests. <laughs> That'd be so cool once we move to be like, yes. Okay, so we put the Wintry Princess. Where am I going? In there. And we got to fill it up with MJ. Um, how was I going to do this? Oh yeah, water plus coal um, on. Why is it still saying we got some in there? Uh, have we got any coal? Oh yeah, we got a bit of coal there. So we'll put some coal in there. Put our steam engine to work that we were so lucky to find. So yeah, that will uh, heat up. And then we may need some more steam in there. So have we got a bucket? I, I'm so sorry. I apologize about this constant chest searching, chest searching that we're gonna get there. Sorry about my stutter there. This piece. Yeah. So I um, was going to be without internet for all four days, but I found out that we're not we're gonna be without internet for a week and a half. Um, so yeah, um, not good. So I'm in a massive rush at the moment. I'm recording a hell of a lot. Okay, so we're going to make this hazmat suit so we can deal with the um, uranium without uh, getting radiation poisoning. So that's just rubber and dye. I did get everything we need off camera, so we've got rubber. Hopefully that's enough rubber. And uh, where's my dye? I know I put my dye in here somewhere. Come on, I thought I put them in the same chest. Yeah, I did. Okay, cool. So we'll put that there and there. We may need a bit more, actually, now I think about it. A um, bit more rubber. Uh, I might have some sticky resin around. Oh, okay, cool. So it just needs two orange dye. That's so lucky that we it needed two orange dye. Okay, so we put that on. Now we should be protect, protected against radiation. We're about to find out. I feel like I'm moving slower with it on. Okay. Here's my thermal centrifuge. Here we go. Okay, no, we're not protected against your radiation. Oh, God, I'm going to die. I have slept in my bed, though. Uh, you're okay. Okay, let's pick this up because we're going to die anyway. So shove that in there and then pick that up as well. Shove that in there. Uh, what am I missing? I thought hazmat suit. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay. Um, I may have to look into that. I, I thought it must have been a whole suit, but there is nothing else with um, hazmat suit on. So uh, have we got everything now? I think we got everything. Cool. Cool beans. Oh, there's a bit of thing there. So yeah, I'm going to look this up because I did see there could be a bug with this. So I'll be back in a minute. Okay, I'm back. Uh, I figured out what was wrong. I knew it was a whole set. I, well, I knew it was probably going to be a whole set, but uh, it's not named uh, Scoop. It's not named Hazmat Suit. It's actually named Scuba Helmet and Rubber Boots, which is a bit weird. Uh, rubber Boots is just rubber. That's easy. And Scuba Helmet is actually like that. So, you know, fairly easy. So now we should be protected against radiation. 
shall we see? Actually, let's quickly get our uranium out. Uranium. Uh, enriched uranium. So yeah, it's just like that. So yeah. Okay, cool. Let's grab these out. Are we protected? Looks like we are. Cool. So enrich uranium. Do that. And we'll take two of them. Because I know we can do two at a time. So yeah, we'll shove that down there. Uranium 235. Um, 238. Uranium 235? Oh, uh, yeah, that's all. Sorry, it's just my physics knowledge coming into mind. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, we need to put... We need to make a... a uh, one of these. Uranium fuel rod. And now we need just a um, fuel rod, which is metal former, which we got. And iron plates. And we got iron plates, so we also want another iron plate. Have we got one? Oh, yeah, we got two. Good. And that thing is really going to town, isn't it? Um, why isn't this filling up? Ah, oh, come on! It should be filling up. MJ? MJ? Okay, fine. Uh, by the way, I put my radiation right next to my um, beast, so... Yeah, that's uh, probably helpful. Okay, so let's do that. And we we'll put that up there. Uh, I have no reason, no idea why it should, it's not working. Okay, welcome back. And uh, you fool, I forgot the mutagen producer, didn't you? Uh, but yeah, I made this furnace generator. Ah, this is why I love the um, the extra utilities mod and stuff. Uh, because it just like helps with converting electricity so easily. Like, ah, I mean, come on. This is producing RF and apparently it's making MJ. It's just like, what? What? And I couldn't get this one to work for love, no money. I just don't know why. But yeah, mutagen producer. To get that, we just need... To, we're not going to use our enriched uranium. We could use glowstone, uranium, um, redstone. Um, yeah, glowstone or redstone. Actually, we do have a ton of actual normal uranium that's um, going to be quite useless for a moment. Um, let's see. I don't think this one will work in it. Let's try. Oh, apparently it will. Um, okay, so that is uh, producing mutagen. I'm going to use that. That's fine. And uh, yeah, so that will do its thing. So let's go set up. Oh, wait, one more thing we got to do. I'll put in this. So yeah, we got one uranium fuel rod. We got a lever that we need. We got a heat vents. And we got a nuclear reactor. Should have everything we need. Uh, let's do an energy cell. Um, yeah, let's use. Um, yeah, let's use copper cable. Why not? To be fine. <laughs> um, so let's um, now we've got our uranium fuel cells. We'll leave that to do its thing, and we're um, and uh, go away. So yeah, let's uh, go firmly away from our base, shall we? Uh, quite far. Um, and I believe it might kill the surrounding areas. So uh, yeah, let's um, sort this out, shall we? Let's put it over here. And we got a little energy cell, so we don't need to worry about it. Let's put our um, thing down here. Boom. I don't care if we're making it inefficient, because I want the... Um, this isn't the actual goal, the nuclear reactor. So, yeah, let's uh, turn out to orange. Um, okay, apparently this won't work. <laughs> okay, so if it just makes power on its own, that's fine. Okay, so we'll put the lever there. And we've got to set this up correctly. So, what's the X bit? Oh, I believe that's like, you need to put more nuclear reactors and stuff there to uh, have it work. So we'll put like, um, fuel rods there like that. And we'll put a heat vent either side like that. And we'll move this one firmly away from it. And that should be cool. So let's turn that on. Oh, that was scary. Oh, look, listen to that, um, listen to that noise. That's horrible. Okay, so let's um, leave that to do its thing. And let's go get a wooden transport pipe for energy to try and convert it over. And we'll also get uh, our other lidstone energy cell that we have. We might make a couple, actually. Whoa, does that rubber boots just do that? Ah. Wow, okay, cool. Well, rubber boots can handle um, fall damage. Nice. Because you have to use one bit of wool for it. So, um, yeah, it makes sense, kind of. So, yeah, let's go do this. We might go check on our bees again in a minute. Um, wow, our nuclear reactor, man. Just miles away, just sitting there in the forest, ready to explode. I mean, uh, so, looks like these uh, heat vents are holding up. Because, uh, basically, if you were to take the fuel rod out, 
it cools down like that. So yeah, we are doing good at the moment. So let's see if plugging it in will not explode it. I'm surprised that it won't explode if we don't get rid of the power. Um, okay. Uh, do we have to go off a different side, maybe? Uh, or will Billcraft... Uh, looks like Billcraft power won't, uh, won't cut it. Um, hmm. Okay, so... Uh, I'm going to wait. I'm going to make a cut because A, we need to wait for the nitrogen to do its thing and I want to see if we can figure out a way of storing the energy. So yeah, I will be back in a minute. Okay, welcome back and uh, if you haven't noticed already, White Queen is in there so it's done its thing and everything. And uh, so yeah, let's uh, go on and everything. I couldn't find a way of uh, storing energy using industrial craft so I, I gave up in the end. <laughs> So, ooh, cultivated drone, cultivated princess, and common drone. Nice. If we keep doing that, we will, um, we'll be around to go. Cultivated drone, common drone. Okay, so we put our white queen in here, and we will shove it in with a cultivated drone. Um, oh, wait, no, that's already a queen, so we don't need to. Um, so we will put our cultivated queen back in. Well, cultivated drone, that's to make a load of other cultivated stuff. So I think I'm getting this now, guys. Um, basically... I believe you put in a um, cultivated princess and a cultivated um, drone and then whatever you get out will either be cultivated or um, or a lower tier so but it's mostly going to be cultivated stuff and then you'll have a chance of going up a tier as well and it's I believe it's the same with common and stuff so yeah we gotta wait for them to do its thing and oh ho okay never mind we got a white comb already so that should be quest complete. Awesome. So diamond or bee bag. Diamonds are easy to get. So yeah, well, especially with our mine that's below us. So bee bag. Right. Hold your breath. Three, two, one. Oh, yay. <laughs> A rocky um, drone. So yeah. Um, should we go over here and check on our nuclear reactor? Uh, after that, I have no idea. We all have to look at the quest. That really does sound bad. So, yeah, we are... Our uranium is going down. Cool. Nuclear reactor is in EU mode. Sort of mode of put by 50%. What? Okay. Oh, I was hoping you could change it to EU mode or whatever. Then I was like, oh, awesome. But, alas, no, it wasn't meant to be. So, yeah, I have to look up a way of storing power. But either way, we've got to make loads of those... Um, Depleted energy cells, and plus with about a week and a half of no internet, I'm gonna have um, yeah, I'm gonna have enough time to do that. So yeah, um, so let's go open up the drone manual. Go back and genetics. We've opened up or dripping. I have no idea how to get any of these things. So if anyone like can weigh in on how to do this, then uh, yeah, that would be much appreciated. Uh, genetics, genetic sampler. Rewards less than energy cell. Oh, a full one. Nice. And, uh, yeah. So, genetic one. Let's go get a genetics thing. Hey, that's a point, actually. Well, I, I just came out of it in my head. I, I know. I just said um, that's a point for no reason, really. Um, we're going to be using IC2 NG machines. So, EU is just an annoying power. It's like... Uh, IC2 Industrial Craft 2 is the, like, the only thing which, like... I know uses EU, apart from Railcraft actually. Not even Railcraft I don't think actually. Does it use EU? No, it uses MJ. And Railcraft is the only thing I know that uses MJ. Ah, it's really weird. RF! There's a way to go people. RF. Uh, so, genetic sampler. Let's have a look how to make that. Uh, oh, gen genetic. Genetic. Uh, okay. Genetic. How do you spell genetic? Sorry. Sorry, I'm awful spelling. Genetic. Yeah, I typed in that, didn't I? Genetic. Etic. Did I not type that in? Okay, I must have not. Okay, genetic sampler. Um, tinkers. Yeah, these are easy. Oh, we've made most of this stuff before. So bronze. Iron. Um, diamond. Yeah, we should have. This. Yeah, I may have another pulsating chipset as well. Um, so a lot of copper. Hell of a lot of copper. Uh, yeah, a hell of a lot of copper. Um, so yeah, I might, so I think I might end the episode there, guys, because, uh, I need to take a break off camera and, um, 
get some copper and stuff and uh, make bronze. So yeah, I think I'm going to end it there. When we uh, come back, it'll be episode 9, I believe. Uh, ooh, how long has this been here and we just haven't noticed? Seriously? Um, so yeah, um, we should have... Uh, when we come back, we will have the um, depleted energy cells there. And we will probably make um, the things off camera, like on camera or whatever. So yeah, and uh, hopefully I can do that before I run out of any internet. Oh, it don't matter actually. I can just record. I can record this without internet. So yeah, uh, hopefully you enjoyed. Leave a like, leave a comment. Oh, I love reading the comments. Definitely leave a like, guys. Just hit it like that, you know. Hit the like button like that. Hit your keyboards. And uh, yeah, um, so yeah, leave a comment as well. I love reading your comments. And I will see you in the next episode.